pulls in a million. There's no Sour Patch jokes on you. Hey everyone, it's Savannah. In today's video, we are gonna be trying crumble cookies. And yes, I know it's a really big hype right now. It's all over TikTok, it's on YouTube, it's just everywhere. Crumble cookies are like the best cookies. Um, before we get started, also, it's not sponsored. Not sponsored. But subscribe to our YouTube channel because we're amazing and give us a thumbs up. But um, we're going to go and try some crumble cookies and I'll tell you if it is actually worth the hype. I, I know if it's worth the hype, but I don't know if you do. So we're going to do this together. This week is candy week. Um, so they've got like, I think, a Sour Patch. I'm, the only one that I can remember is a Sour Patch because I thought, that, wow, that's really weird in a cookie. And I'm really curious how they even put that in a cookie. But that is what we're doing today. We're testing them out and seeing if they're good enough to try in yourself. Yeah, if you have a crumble near you. Some people don't have a crumble near, but if you're like visiting places, there's always a crumble, so. Um, but Candy Week is today, and by the time you actually probably watch this video, is not gonna be Candy Week, and I really apologize, but the cookies always do come back. So maybe Candy Week will be next week, or, or not next week, but like in a year and a half. It's gonna be a little while before they have candy week again, but you know what I mean. They if they change out every week, it's a whole different story. But let, let's stop hearing me rant about cookies and let's just go in and try them and then I'll bring them back to you guys. It's busy, I don't like it being this busy. Cookies, four, oh my God. Oh my God, two of them are sold out. Okay, so. We want an M&M. Um, oh, oh, the Sour Patch is sold out. Seriously? Is there a different location we go? Okay, so, new plan. Um, the crumble cookies we went, there the crumble cookie we went to is actually out of literally two of the four flavors. The Sour Patch one. The Sour Patch and the Kit Kat. So, we're gonna abandon ship on this crumble cookie and go to a different crumble cookie to see if they have the certain flavors. Well, the problem is so, they're closed on Sunday, which is tomorrow, and cookie the cookie week ends today. Yeah, so we wanna get there. It's, <laughs> what, 17 minutes away? So we gotta hurry. All right, we'll see you guys at the second location. And then everyone was just so close to me. Like, I felt so invaded of space. Okay, yes, the people, that, and it wasn't the employees, but the people in there, they were very aggressive. Savannah paused for like one second um, as she walked in the door, and this lady like wanted to punch her. I, it was it was aggressive. So maybe that was part I of was the reason. I was bumped more than three times <laughs> in the matter of two minutes that we were in there. And then we found out they were out of cookies. So um, that may have been a, a contributing factor to us leaving that one because of the aggressive people. But again, candy ten week right. is ending. Then ten. Yeah. Right. And so Decide maybe that's it. Right. Maybe they're all desperate for cookies too. And in um, four hours, the place closes and there's no more candy cookies. That's probably true, but. How are you out of candy cookies? Make more! Make more! It's not that hard. I know, but it ends tonight, so why would they make more? I don't know. Okay, this is take two. It looks busy. And, um, yes, we did go to a different location because we didn't like the people and they didn't have our, our um, cookies we wanted and we're a little picky with our cookies, clearly. But, it just means we love their cookies and we want to try their candy cookies. So. Here we are, second location, let's try this again. I don't know if we can even try it a third time because there's not a closer one, so I guess it's with our luck right now. Um, let's hope there are cookies and that there are nice people this time. I wanna worry you staying staying outside and hearing it run over my car. <laughs> This one has no Sour Patch also. And no, what's the other one? No M&M. But we're not sad about the M&M, we're sad about the Sour Patch. Yeah. We so. have to call Maya, which is one of my friends who's already had it, and we can ask her how it was. So we're gonna get the Butterfinger, the Kit Kat, and the Heath, and probably two Butterfingers. You so we want Kit Kat. Kit Kat. That. Chilled sugar's out too. Oh my well, god. Well, now we have Kit Kat. Okay, so get two of the Butterfinger. And that one. Chocolate I'm not, Yeah, because milk, milk chocolate is just super boring. No, it's boring. Okay, so we have, what, what is that one? This one's the uh, Kit Kat. Two Butterfinger and the Heath. Yeah, so we're gonna get a four box. <laughs> so this is where you can actually watch them make it, which is really cool. So they're literally making our cookies right now. I don't see any Sour Patch Kids cookies yeah. though. I mean, I these are for tomorrow. I bet you're for that for tomorrow. Oh, because that's like a chocolate one. Yeah. Huh. Well, no, they're not open on Sundays. 
so I don't think so. But look at the size of these cookies. We'll show you that in a second of how big they are. You can see. They're huge. Yes. They're about as big as your head. That's the heat. That's the kick it. It says, they're, oh, they'll be back soon, but not right now. Butterfinger. She's disappointed. Disappointed. She's disappointed that, uh, first of all, it's raining, so it's like misting like crazy snow. She's di Let's not get hit by a car, though. Oh, yeah, hold on. Let's get okay. in the car, and we'll tell you well, this. <laughs> okay, Savannah's disappointed. And Savannah's disappointed. Oh, I almost dropped the camera. Savannah's disappointed because, first of all, we, we would have talked to you more while we were in there. It was so loud. It was loud and busy, and the people on Saturday night are really aggressive with their cookies. I don't know what to say. Um, so, we gave you what we could, but why are you upset? Because they go... Oh, we're sold out of chilled sugar. I see like 12 of them sitting on the counter. They were in bags, which means I think they probably were for to-go orders. But you know what? If you're not there, I say you miss out. No, you miss out. Right. You but, sell the 12 you have. Right. We didn't see any Sour Patch, and they were out of those. So we did get four of the candy ones, so we are going to try those. Someone for sure hogged them. Yeah. Someone went into that place and went, you, well, you got 12 Sour Patch left? I'm gonna buy them all right now. And it did look like they were, they they like were making more, them. but it, it didn't look like they were making any more Sour Patch. So I don't, I, my, my guess is they didn't, they ran out of Sour Patch dough. candies. Yeah. And dough. Because they were making dough for probably the rain or the night, but they're closed on Sundays, so yeah, they're someone, not making from tomorrow. Yeah, but if someone came in and like got 12, you could have sold them for a little bit more on the sidewalk over there. <laughs> or they'll probably have them in an hour and they just haven't, they just don't want to say that to people. Oh, but we weren't going to wait an hour. So yeah. let's show you what we got. Okay, first of all, the box is warm. These are warm cookies. All of them are warm. Which one's that one? That one's the Kit Kat one. That one's Kit Kat. I think it's a, a Kit Kat based cookie. Um, I'm a little disappointed with the amount of chocolate on top. Yeah, though. that's that's not a good showing. Okay, but no. this one looks pretty good. I would like you guys, but we're almost out of battery on our phone. Oh, yeah, um, that's true. This one's Butterfinger. That's Butterfinger. Um, looks good. Like a, It's a peanut butter cookie with peanut Butterfinger inside. Butterfinger on crumbles on top and a chocolate drizzle. Those both are... There's Butterfinger. Peanut, or Butterfinger, and then... Okay, so that that's how you do topping. Heath. That's Heath, but that, that's, that's topping. That's better topping. That's not so good topping. <laughs> that's good topping. topping. Okay, so that's <laughs> Heath. So I think that's whipped cream. I don't know how whipped cream or icing has to do with Heath. Maybe like a Heath cake. Under, yeah. Okay, because it looks like a chocolate-based cookie. Heath is on top. There's probably Heath in the cookie. And then we will tell you when we get back to our hotel if it is a special whipped cream so okay let's go try these but they're all yeah. super warm that's the greatest thing about crumble is first of all the cookies are the size of your head and they're freshly made second they're warm delicious sorry i was focusing on the guy next to me who parked so close to my car super crooked too dude's gotta like pulls in a million there's no sour patch jokes on you oh hey guys welcome back to our room um so we're gonna try the cookies and tell you if they're even worth getting next time these come out so next time the candy ones come out so if the heath the, the butterfinger the kit kat and the kit kat so if you see those on the schedule for crumble we'll let you know if they're worth getting yes we don't have any knives or forks <laughs> or plates or napkins or anything so what we do have is a <laughs> coffee stir stick <laughs> that we found in the hotel. It was either that or a ballpoint pen. We went for the stir stick. So we're gonna just taste them and we're going to tell you which are the best and which are um, worth good. getting again. They're all gonna be good. Well, clearly they all look delicious, but right. I think there are certain ones that are definitely worth getting. And I think, I don't know, I'm gonna guess the Butterfinger for me. Which one are you gonna do first? Let's just do them in order. Okay, you're doing them in order. Yeah. Okay. There's no way this is going to be We're just going to have to take a piece, like a little piece of it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, there. Okay. <laughs> okay. Just try to get a chunk, girl. This is the Kit Kat one. I don't remember what's in the cookie. Obviously, Kit Kat. But, like, I don't know if it's a peanut butter-based cookie or what kind of cookie it is. <laughs> 
gosh, we should have got some napkins or something. Okay. <laughs> That's good. It's just like a normal chocolate chip cookie. I was just gonna say, it tastes like a chocolate chip cookie with some melted chocolate on top. I get no Kit Kat flavor whatsoever. Not at all. It's good though, but it tastes like a chocolate chip cookie. Okay, so, good. Yeah, I didn't get any, any um, Kit Kat Kit Kat flavor. Kit Kat flavor, I don't, but Kit Kat's not a peanut butter. What is Kit Kat? Oh, it's a wafer. It's like, yeah, it's a wafer. So I don't think that translates very well. Now this is the one we're most excited about. Oh wait, just let me show you, because clearly I've washed my hands. Don't worry. This is the size, Ooh. these are the size of the cookies. As you can see, it blocks Savannah's head because it's the size of her head. <laughs> so I wouldn't suggest like eating these on a regular basis, like all of them, but hey, it's a special occasion. We're in a hotel uh, without napkins. <laughs> Feeling very bad about that. Okay. Okay, it's a peanut butter based cookie with There's peanut butter. With Butterfinger in the cookie and the chocolate. And this is my favorite cookie so far. Mm -hmm. I really like it, but I really like peanut butter cookies. And and this one is definitely like, peanut butter. It's like that. moist in the middle, a little crunchy on the outside. Mm -hmm. Yep. Um, and the little chocolate chisel adds a little bit to the top too, because it's a little bit more flavor. Bring that, so. Maybe. How did you? How did what? Because I've been cutting them. Oh. I'm cutting them and then trying to divide them. <clears throat> and I'm kind of messy. Okay, last one. Here's the thing. We really wanted to try the um, Sour Patch Kids for you. Even though Sour Patch Kids seems super weird to me in a cookie, but it was put in the cookie and on top, and it was like a lemon lime cookie. I, I don't want to know. Try I it. really wanted to try it. So that and the M&M, I mean it's an M&M cookie. Well, it, I mean, I can't imagine it was anything special. Come on, you, you can't get M&M cookie wrong. Right. Okay, so I'm very curious. Let me show you this one really quick. I know we already showed it to you. Holy man. Here, did you wash your hands? Yes. Okay, just feel how heavy it is. Oh, jeez. Okay, so this one has some kind of a, I don't want to say gloss, because it's not a gloss. What is that? I don't have any idea. Maybe it's caramel. Okay, so that is the cookie, the Heath cookie. Now, I did, uh, I did cheat and tasted the top. The top is a whipped cream, just a basic whipped cream, not a Heath bar flavored whipped cream. Um, it's kind of weird. It is kind of crazy that there's whipped cream on top of it. Now, after I after stabbing the cookie with the <laughs> coffee stirrer, um, there's no nice way to do this. Um, but it's a chocolate-based cookie. Okay. I'm just gonna take it and then grab. Yeah, and then just like scoop the whipped cream up. Yeah. I don't know. I'm having a really hard time with this. Okay, it's a chocolate-based cookie with some kind of a drizzle and whipped cream. That's coconut drizzle. Nice for sure coconut. Wait for it, it hits. There's coconut. I don't know where the coconut, what does coconut have to do with Heath Bar? There's, you, you it's for coconut. sure coconut. It's 100% coconut. But what does that have to do with Keith or Heath Bar? N nothing. And the, it's not the icing, or the, the, fro the, it's not frosting, it's whipped cream. The whipped cream is basic whipped cream. So there is a coconut drizzle underneath the whipped cream be, yeah. and a chocolate based cookie. There's no Heath in it besides the Heath on top. That's it. I'm getting zero heat. Okay, so I got zero Kit Kat except on the top and zero heat. Um, it's really, really good. No, they're they're really good. Really good, but the coconut is unexpected. You don't expect coconut no. on a heat cookie. There's coconut. Um, no. They just need to rename it and not call it the heat. It needs to be some kind of like a yeah. coconut cake. Yeah, it's so a I definitely cake. think my, the peanut butter one's my favorite. Yeah, Butterfinger is hands down oh, a favorite, so. Butterfinger. Yeah, if you are going to, if you see these, a Heath, a Kit Kat, or a Butterfinger, Butterfinger. at Crumble, go for Butterfinger. Yeah. Um, and then if you see Sour Patch, you gotta just do it just because. I mean, I don't, I don't we don't know how good it is, but it's gotta be good. Right? Nice. Yeah, that's, that's really it though. Yeah. So Butterfinger was our favorite. That's pretty much it guys. Thank you for joining us on our adventure. It was a success. Crumble. Even though we went to twi two cup Crumbles. It we, was got, we got to, we got to, to taste the cookies. We'll, we'll eat these tomorrow. Yeah, We just course. wanna taste them tonight, but. Yeah, all right. Well, that's it, guys. Thank you so much for joining us. We'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and give us a video a thumbs up. Bye, Bye, guys. Bye, guys.